Yo, what is good, YouTube? And welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with the brand new Emerald Steve Novak, who is literally exclusively a shooter. I want to see how his release is. If he has a bad release, he is completely unusable. If he has a very good release, he will at least be fun to shoot with because he has like 45 speed. He's one of the worst defensive cards I've seen all year. He looks like an inside seven foot three he looks like roy hibbert basically defensively except with no interior defensive block or anything like that like his defense is y'all will see it's pretty pitiful um with that being said though before we hop into the video if you haven't already mixed you hit that subscribe button help me push towards the 14,000 subscriber mark on the channel we hit 13k yesterday really appreciate all the recent support on the channel uploading like a minimum of six videos a day a lot of days it's seven eight nine videos so we'd really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe it's looking like it's gonna be eight today so without further ado let's hop right into it steve novak 6 10 80 85 offense, 70 defense with a 65 driving layup, 83 mid-range, 93 ball, 85 free throw. Outside of that, pretty much everything else on this card is bad. He has a 74 pass accuracy, which is okay-ish, can barely dunk. 50 driving dunk means he will probably dunk wide open. He's 6'10", you would hope so, right? But defensively, he's pretty much the worst card I've ever seen, ever. Same thing rebounding. Um, I guess he's 6'10", so maybe he'll rebound occasionally. Um, the speed, 45 speed and excel at power forward or small forward is pretty remarkably bad. And then uh, 62 vertical, 69 strength. He has 98 stamina. That's pretty fire. 98 hustle as well. Yeah, and then 39 lateral quickness. Okay, so he can shoot. Gold blinders, catch and shoot, clamor, corner special, slippery off ball, green machine and guard up on silver, dead eye and limitless range on a bronze. Again, all shooting badges. Basically everything on this card besides the three shooting badges, sh shooting stats and all of his sh shooting badges, which are mid range shot, three point shot, free throw, and then those shooting badges. Everything else is pretty terrible on this card. Like it's the most drastic. It's like Mike Miller, but worse basically. And that release isn't even that great. It's okay. And I'm probably going to shoot hopefully pretty well with him in this game. It's not a bad release, but it's certainly not good enough to justify. He would basically have to have like the best release in the game by a significant margin right now to be justifiable to play in anybody's lineup pretty much because he's so slow everywhere else. Would not recommend using this card in the slightest unless you are playing offline because online he is going to get completely exploited for being as slow and as poor defensively as he is and he also has absolutely no shot creation ability at all as he hop steps from outside the, the paint and finishes a dog so maybe he's a dog i don't know but uh yeah let's be honest he's not going to do anything besides shoot the ball but he hasn't missed an open three yet so i will say that his release it may not be the fastest release i've ever seen it's still very good and it is really easy to green so he is certainly going to shoot the crap out of the ball there's no doubt about that is he gonna do anything else absolutely not besides i guess do bad things he's not gonna do good things but um i mean i literally haven't missed i'll say that that's kind of crazy the fact that i have not missed a single shot with him in what a minute in freestyle i think i'm nope i didn't miss that one either um so he's kind of crazy i guess i don't know i missed that one it was a fade but every catch and shoot shot i have made that's kind of crazy so i don't know maybe he's a hooper let's hop into a game let's see what steve novak can do all right, our opponent has John Starks, Desmond Bain, Cam Whitmore, Jabari Smith, and Miles Turner. Pretty budget squad right here. Um, I guess Jabari Smith is only, what, 68 speed, so I guess it's not the biggest speed mismatch in the history of the game, but it's still a pretty big one. Uh, with that being said, let's see what we can do. If he can if he can get space for catch and shoot, I'm shooting it every single time. Uh, did not get space for a catch and shoot there. That was a bad shot. Jabari Smith closed out, and he is really, 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 really slow. Like, wow, he's slow it's pretty remarkable how slow he feels um let's see if he can play any defense at all uh no i don't think so contest contest oh my goodness what a defensive play look at steve novak with the defensive contest and we're just in scramble to drill defense at all times because as soon as he passes it to the guy guarding steve novak it's a wide open uh catch and shoot again that's john starks that time oh my gosh i thought i was gonna green that i don't green a 20 29 percent really that's okay straight up here with brandon roy i should get a stop and that's good defense and we are going to push the ball and transition again hitting steve novak this time we're front fading from limitless hey yes sir look at steve novak knocking it down big shot from the boy steve novak if i can get a steal this game we will be cooking let's go good defense yup good d steve never mind <laughs> let me not guess it let me not guess it let me not guess it but good shot uh let's play some defense here uh or play some offense here i mean escape here with Kyrie. Kyrie's going to attack the rim. We're going to hit our pop. You should not leave him wide open. That is, oh my gosh. I didn't miss a single wide open shot. I didn't miss a single catch and shoot shot in freestyle. As soon as I get in a game, I missed my first one. How am I so garbage, bro? 
Oh my goodness, his release is so money and I'm missing wide open. That's really embarrassing. My bad. Um, all right, back up here. Between the legs again, Kyrie's gonna attack the Ram. You gotta stop leaving him open, bro. Yo, he got such a lucky animation there. What is, what is that? He was literally wide open for three and he stepped in for no reason at all. Um, X switch this, that's great defense here. Scotty Pippen. I mean, I X switched it. I clicked on and I tried to jump. That's as good as I could try to play that defensively. He gets a dunk on Pippen. It's okay. Uh, but I like that defense still. I thought I played that pretty well. Uh, pop again. That's enough space. Dude, if I miss, it's because of the delay. I'm just timing the release a little bit wrong. But at the same time, that's really bad. I've been late on both of them. I'm, uh, his release is... Dang, bro. No chance I'm missing two wide open shots with a Steve Novak. That is really, really bad. Like, I should literally never miss with him. That's that's my fault. No excuses. His release is way too good for that to happen. Um, bad take there, though. Good defense by Anthony Davis. Pushing the ball up the court again. Brandon Roy. Now we find Steve Novak in transition again. We catch and shoot that time. And that one is slightly early. Holy crap. What is going on? It went in, though. Thank you. Man, I suck. I am so bad. I am so bad. His release is so easy, and I have missed three times wide open. That is really embarrassing. I need to really improve as a shooter in this game. Good defense there. We got enough of a contest. We're good. Straight up. He's boxed. He's honestly boxed. Steve Novak pass. Good. We're going to swing. We're going to swing. He's going to shoot a bad shot, and we're going to get the board. Let's go. Push the ball in transition again. Let's see if we can hit Steve Novak front fading again. Pump fake. Um, we're going to push cross here. He is so slow. Why am I trying to create? Oh, he's a hooper. Never mind. I lied. What a pass. What a pump fake. What a dunk. Steve, Steve uh, Novak, the playmaker, just throwing it into to, to, for, to uh, AD for the easy bucket. Steve Novak got wall of defense too. Oh my goodness, Steve Novak's like that. Oh my goodness, he's like that. Look at the defense. That's not because of, I think a 25 defense is going to get a stop there if they're tall enough there, 25 interior, because of the way the, uh, the uh the wall up animation is when you get that specific animation so good playmaking oh my gosh why am i out here hooping with steve novak playing defense and playmaking doing the stuff that he should not be able to do it's more because my opponent's kind of doing dumb things more than anything else and you see this 45 speed right there as he's somehow able to almost get back and kind of contest but he jumps at nothing and doesn't really get the contest um i mean not really much else to see with this card. He's a shooter. We know this. If I could just green. Um, okay, that's a bad shot. His release is not that fast, though. Not an excuse at all for missing three times wide open with him at all. At all. But um, the fact that I've made him look like a better defender and I just lied. We, there's no defense at all. But AD comes over and rotates and makes a play because AD is a dog on the defensive end. Do would not recommend using this card in any sort of atmosphere with Steve Novak. He can't guard pick and roll. He's going to get ran around out of the corner. He's not going to rebound well. He's not going to do anything well. He's not going to get interior stops if the person's in good defense, offensive position at all. If he takes bad shots, he'll get stops, but he's still going to get dunked on and not get contests and stuff like that defensively. But offensively, he's a shooter. He's open. He just doesn't have the fastest release in the world. And I mean, I missed three times open with him, which is really embarrassing, but uh, swing it out to AD here. Swing it back over to Kyrie. Let's go pick and pop here. I'm going to take my layup here if I have to with uh, Kyrie because I just don't think. Oh, that's so frustrating. Why is he popping? Shoot the ball. Shoot the ball. Get it up because maybe we get the offensive rebound. That's why we had to get it up. But I almost got the offensive rebound, but I didn't. Uh, X switch this inside on. That's good defense by Pip and jump. Only up one with 20 seconds left. Okay, we got to make our free throws here. Um, 18 seconds left. That's a lot of time. I don't think I'm going to give up a three here. I'm, I'm willing to give up twos because I feel like I'll just make all of my free throws. Should have thrown it to uh, Novak, honestly. He's got an 85 free throw, and I want to see what his free throw release is. So I trust him to make his free throws. Uh, so I guess we'll do that if he scores here and fouls again or something. But... Eh, I mean, you know what you're getting with this card. He's a shooter, and I didn't shoot very well with him in this game, to be completely honest, which is kind of embarrassing. But, uh, I mean, he's, he's a shooter, and that's it. And if you expected anything else even coming into this video, you're short-sighted, to be honest, and just kind of tripping. What was that shot? Throw it over to... Oh, he intentionally fouled immediately, and why is he pausing? Why would you pause? You're the one who shot a very early from... A step behind four-point range with Miles Turner. I don't know what, what the thought process to that shot was. I don't think there's a center in this game that I'd recommend shooting that with right now, except for maybe freaking Dirk or Steve Novak if he can play center. Um, but he can't. He's power forward. I guess he can technically play small forward. It'd just be the slowest small forward in the game. Uh, but yeah, that's... I think that's everything for this gameplay. Not really anything else to talk about, to be honest. This card is pretty mid. Very mid, actually. He's still fouling. What a waste of time. Ah, uh, it's, it's, it's the intentional fouls. Whatever. Let's hop back to the main menu and let's view the card.
All right, Steve Novak, literally just a shooter. Cannot do anything else. I actually played pretty well with him in that game, but my opponent wasn't very good, which is why he actually got a couple defensive stops and stuff like that. Uh, and we did wind up coming out with a win, so that's a W. Getting a win in a gameplay centered around a Steve Novak that can't do anything but shoot, and I missed three wide open shots of them. You wouldn't think I would win the game. But um, it looks like we did come out of there with a W, so that's cool. This card is not worth using unless you're a Knicks fan. My boy Big Bird, though, if you're watching this video, shout out to you. Um, as well as Khalil, if you're watching this by any chance, my Knicks fans, my Knicks fan boys. Uh, I know Big Bird especially is excited about the Steve Novak card, but unfortunately, he kind of sucks. So hopefully y'all did enjoy. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. I'll be back with more 2K content very, very soon. I appreciate y'all. Peace.